Do do do. Come on and do the market. Do do do. Okay, bud. He said he won't come in, but we're here. It's our ganders. This is all we've got today, mate. It's absolutely chucking it down. Got to find something. Exactly. Exactly. What is it? Seventy quid. Then. Seventy quid. Reckons. Or something, don't he? He's not attached to it. What the hell is that? How much is that thing? What? 50p. There's a quid there. Where's that chicken? Chicken's meant to be attached to something. Yeah. Cheers, bud. It's meant to be attached to us. The chicken. I don't know what that dinosaur is, I just feel like I've seen it before somewhere. <coughs> How much are uh, your little dudes? You've got a pound each on them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Could do you eight quid for all of them? It's just that I've sold all the stamps. Yeah, it's alright, I'll leave them on Snado. Cheers, bud. How much is Buzz? Uh, that's a fiver, that. Uh, it'll probably be down. Go on, I'll grab him then. Three, four. I've got another one, Taz. I've got another one. Yeah, that's five. Alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I've got the head on that. It's a thought oh, that was Power Rangers, but it's Spider-Man, isn't it? There you go. Found a llama. You don't get the joke, do you? Found a llama. Oh, get the return. Unless you're buying toys today, boys, I don't think there's anything else, is there? That's a red panda, isn't it? Yeah, soaking wet though. Hands are freezing. Absolutely pissing it down. Well, you can see how bad it's raining by that puddle, mate. But charity shop or somewhere's good. Is that filler bag still for a fiver there? Has it run out? I don't know. We'll have to go there. We'll have to go have a look, won't we? Wicked, doesn't it? Four quid. Well, they keep that for me then. Come on, see him. I've never seen these before, I didn't mean it was quite expensive. I think last time. Three quid. Absolute bargain. The tag's worn off on them, but it is a size six for three quid. I'll scrub them all right then. What's the going with them? Yeah, 15, 20. There it is again. Look, fill a bag for a fiver. Let's get in there. See so if we can get all this in a bag for a fiver. We've got a ping. Trespass Gillet, the Mountain Warehouse Fleece, the Caramore Jumper, and the Mountain Warehouse Gillet again. Fine. Bargain. You got a spare 30 quid, mate? Let's just see how good it is before I buy it. You look alright, now. Two XL. Fine. Two quid. Shirt master. Look at that head in the corner. The fucking card machine. Eight quid. What's going on? Something Disney in it. Oh, it's decorations. <laughs> what are these? Strapless bras. Push up bra, I probably need one of them. That's eight quid, I just scanned on eBay, let's have a look. Last one sold at £2.25, £3.00. 
What's this? Oh, no, what's this? Sorry. Jessica Jones. Look at it. Turn it over. Is it a necker? Marvel. Yeah, that is. Are they sketches? No. Get it. Transformer, isn't it? A couple of them, I think. You don't want it on it. Oh. Uh, come on in, guys. Did you ask me? Fiber. Could be a shout. Everyone knows what I'm doing. I'm going to the toy section. Peter will have it for a quid. He's got some value. What's well, 350? Well, we'll do with that. Is we'll just pull that straight off. Said a quid on that, didn't it? Somewhat. Mm, Peter Rabbit. Quid for a nice little Harley looking bike. Peter Rabbit might be a shout. Tell him. If you get a baby with a thingy, maybe not. So that part of the video then. I've just pulled up at home, checked my phone two things to say so it's Kaji Ran right now number one uh, got a negative review again on eBay so I'm like this is taking the fucking piss now there's no way I've got 13 bad reviews so I looked to see what it was it was a barber coat hanger that snapped I'd sent off I sent one off and apparently it snapped in half straight away by looking at it this is not excuses or anything like that but looking at it I sent a dark like a dark uh, brownie colored one out in the picture the one that they showed me that snapped is light brown but I messaged him and said, Bud, how come you left me negative feedback straight away? You should have messaged me. I could have sorted you a refund and all I can do is apologise. I wrapped it the best I could. And if it goes through every around mail, it's, you know, they've, they've caused me a problem, but I can refund you. He said, oh, sorry, buddy. I didn't know. I thought that's how you messaged people. So, yeah, whatever. He then changed the review to a positive review because I put in a return, uh, a review request, whatever it is. So we're all good. Then he messaged me saying, so I can chuck this now. I said, no, 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 because you, you've opened up a return request. You have to send me the item back. I always do this. doesn't matter if it's broke, damaged, whatever, how much of a cunt I look. If they say something's broke or it's not what they expected and they want a refund, that's perfectly fine. Even if the thing's snapped in half, you will send me it back. And now he's saying, can I chuck this? What do you mean, mate? What do you mean? Can't I just chuck it in the bin? It's going to cost me to send it. No, it's not, because I just paid for a postage label. So 90% of the time, people do this to try and pull a fast one. It's a scam on eBay where... They say the item's broken, you say send it back, and then they go, uh, blah, 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 blah. can't I just chuck it now, can't I just chuck it now? No, you fucking can't, mate. It's not even the item I sent you that's broke, you're going to send me some bullshit back, or you don't have a, genuinely don't have a clue. And the second one is, I've got a bad whatnot review from somebody I think I used to work with. So I think somebody's playing a game here. They said something's like, item arrived dirty, to... How can it arrive dirty? I'll show you it in the whatnot stream. I'll show you what it is, what it looks like, how what damage it's in or whatever. But here's what it is. People are just fucking silly. If anyone ever ever buys anything off me and has a problem, just message me. How hard is it? You know what I mean? If someone's crying over a fiver though, you need to like, you know, sort your life out. But anyway, we're back home. I've got some charity shop pickups because the cab was a bit shit as you've seen in the video. We're gonna run through that stuff and then how much should we do? Get ready for the whatnot stream tonight at seven o'clock. Let's do it. Before I get out of the van, he just messaged me the same bio again saying, haven't got time for that. Because I've told him I paid for a label for him to send it back, which has already been accepted. I've already paid for this label. And he said, oh, I haven't got time for that. Enjoy your money, you're rating safe. Scammer. He tried to scam me and I've fucking done him on that. Just going to get my stuff out of the back. And guess what? If you follow me on Instagram already, Kaji underscore reselling, you've already seen this. But them, uh, them family guy figures from yesterday have just sold. $59.99 plus the shipping. I knew they was worth money. That's why I was so excited. I was like, I'm not keeping them, I'm selling them. And I got rid of them. But there is a pair, well, there's a bunch of them up now on auction that run out in three days on so £5.50. So I'm thinking of uh, went on eBay, this guy's page, and messaged him saying, he take 20 quid for him, see what he says. 
since we're back over the room not to, wouldn't it, to run through everything. So we picked up this Boz Lightyear for a fiver. Did they overpay? More than likely because I needed to pick some of stuff. I went all the way there and it was pissing it down. It is soaked as well. It doesn't work, it's perfectly fine. It just needs a bit of drying. Might see that's on the whatnot stream tonight so we can get rid of it. See, Buzz Lightyear, Universal Space Protection bollocks. Easy on the back, Disney official. Beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful. Don't know how much that's even worth. Uh, Tom Bowler, paid two quid to enter. I won one thing, which was this. Might use it as a giveaway tonight. Um, you see me pick all them bags of toys. Uh, Owen also picked one up, but I bought his off him for three quid, so I made him 50p because he didn't realise how shit there was. But I'll make some money on the toy bundles because there's a lot of toys in there. Pick this up at the car, but it was well 50p because I swear I've seen it somewhere before. Don't know where. I might be chatting crap, might not be worth anything, but I swear I've seen it before somewhere. Yeah, like I say, full brown bag to the brim. As you can see, of just lo loose toys. What not stream tonight for them? Uh, the find that I didn't show because he was at the till of the charity shop and I was like, oh, how much is that? £1.50 for the Walking Dead Monopoly. Is it all there? I don't know, but I'll find out for you. Um, again, at the till of the charity shop, there was this for one ninety nine. It's a Build-A-Bear Ryan's World. So it's that little kid who does YouTube videos, I think. So it might be worth some money. Uh, a couple clothes for whatnot tonight, actually quite a lot of clothes. And then a pair of regattas for two ninety nine. I think it was. Not regardless, that's a lie, see caramels. But I sell these like they're going out of fashion. Yeah, two ninety nine, women's size six. Yeah, then check up on eBay tonight. Well, like I say, the rest of it, so he's put me into a bag, which is what I've got there, so what's this? But yeah, it's pretty much just, guys, all I've got these clothing. Like the filler bag for a fiver. Let's just run through it quick. Little man behind me. So, fill a bag for a five. We've got a caramel jumper. We also put in there a Martin Warehouse fleece. Nice, all nice and clean because obviously washing before. And... Yeah, running through out me, big boy. We've got a trespass extra large gilet. It's got my name all over it, probably, but we'll list that tonight anyway. A nice, clean condition on this. Ping. Polo shirt, nice as golf, it'll fly out that time of year. Uh, what else is in the five pound thing? This Mountain Warehouse, yeah, Mountain Warehouse shirt. Um, this is a quid in a different charity shop. It is a Top Golf coat. Pick that up. I think that's about it, is it? Oh, no, there's another item. It's a Mountain Warehouse gilet. And then another pound in a different charity shop for a Nike running dry fit top thing. You should have Nike. There you go. Oh, that'll be on whatnot tonight. I'll we'll try and get some sales in. Some of the dead stock that we've got. So yeah. So out of these toy bunners, all that's just random toys. I got some animals. One of them's one of them Schnag and German brands, whatever it is. Going through this bag, and I found this. I haven't searched it up yet, but underneath it does say. If you can focus, 1986 Recom Toys. So, oh, what are you doing? Playing with that. Whatever this is. NASA. Might be worth some money. Right, so I'm thinking of doing a whatnot stream in here tonight. It's got all my stuff set up there. So I could maybe get it here. I don't know. Get it there. Something like that. However, it's going to work. Just a lot easier to do it in here. We've got a few on the back of the door here. So, take the dressing gowns up. We're going to hook a picture up. Hook a t shirt on, take a picture. Then I can show it in the video behind me, I don't know. So it's, it's got to change scenery because it's too cold in that shed outside. Can't listen to music, oh, not really much electric in there. But yeah, so that's going to be all for me, guys. I'm hoping to hit Hemswell with the money we've got left over from today, which is still quite a bit. We're spending that money, aren't we? Yeah, which is still quite a bit. So Hemswell tomorrow, and then Monday will be weekend sales video. However, there's two car boots tomorrow. So... If we go to Hemswell make a full video, I could make another full video. So we should have another car boot video out during the week as well. So love you all. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you over on the Whatnot stream. Or if this is uploaded after, thanks for being in there.
and peace.